Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is my road to 10k slash budget update slash paying down debt video. So I think I'm going to start making my road to 10k a different video and then me paying off debt a different video so they're not in the same thing because for the moment I am getting very caught up in paying down my debt before even adding money to my savings to reach 10k so that's what I'm going to do. Um, so these two different videos will be super short but it is what it is. So in the last update I paid off my Chase credit card and I'm so happy, very excited that I finally don't have that lingering over my head. Now, now the thing about that is that, can I say that any more times? How many times can I say that? Um, I really love using my Chase Freedom Card because I get so many rewards. So I think that I'm going to have that as my main credit card when I'm done with paying off debt. I don't know. It sounds pretty psychotic, but I'm going to get this down. Anyway, so the next card that I'm working on is City. And I used this City to transfer money from my Chase Disney card to pay it down but then I kept using my Chase Disney card and that still has a balance as well so that will be a third one after I pay this one off anyways anyways so I just paid off I just paid down $100 to my city card so originally I was at $1,400 now I'm down to $1,300 and um I'm pretty upset because guess what my work did so this paycheck was our third paycheck of June, but my work accidentally took out the deductions that were supposed to be taken out for the first paycheck of July. So I didn't get the money that I worked for basically. Um, and I worked 21 hours of overtime. That should be added to this paycheck that I just got. But because my work messed up and took the deductions out, I got a less amount than I my original paycheck if I don't work overtime which is insane so they're fixing it and the next paycheck will be fixed but like I was counting on this paycheck to really put a dent in this next credit card and my car payment because I had to pay five hundred and sixty dollars to rent a car for the week because my car was in the shop getting fixed and then I also had to pay $340 to get my windshield replaced um, because my car is reimbursing me it's fine but like I had to use my credit card for that so they still owe me the check for that as well um, but by the time you're watching this they sent me my check thank God but like I'm just spending money left and right and it's stressing me out like I'm supposed to be paying down these credit cards but it is not working so life is pretty crazy right now um so I am gonna focus on getting to $1,000 in my savings because I need that right now like I need the emergency fund so bad I've been stuck at $400 for like a few weeks and it's not looking good so um anyways needless to say I did not put down enough money that I wanted to. I would love to put down $400 towards this credit card so then I would be at $1,000. Um, but because of that whole check disaster that's going on with my work, I didn't have enough to throw at it. So I just put $100 down and I'm very hopeful and that I will be putting a bunch of money towards that my next paycheck. So that's what's going on. Everything else is going to be my minimum payment. I'm also putting $150 down towards my savings. Um, so that will be in a new video. But yeah, that's basically what's going on with me. <laughs> what's going on with this savings. And it's just been pretty hectic. I've worked so much overtime. I'm a little stressed out basically, but you know what? You gotta do what you gotta do to pay off your debt. So that's what's going on with me and this paycheck this time around. I cannot wait for my next paycheck, July 12th, I believe. 
because it's going to be pretty big and I will get the money back that's owed to me and it will be all fine. Um, but yeah, that's the update for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you in my next one. Bye.